The FDA will be adding a warning to two of the COVID vaccines. It comes after a CDC advisory panel found that there is a likely association between the vaccines and a rare heart inflammation in young people. The heart condition is called myocarditis. It's an inflammation of the heart muscle. The most common cause is a viral infection. Your heart muscle is not able to pump as efficiently as it does if it doesn't have a viral inflammation. Now, word that the mRNA vaccines may be associated with more than 1,200 cases of this rare heart inflammation in young people. The problem is more likely after the second shot. But it's still rare, roughly 12 cases per million doses of the vaccine. The bottom line for parents, and I have three children myself who've all been vaccinated, we would still um, elect to get the vaccine. Stanford's Dr. Yvonne Maldonado is on the CDC panel. The panel says the benefits of vaccine far outweigh any risk. In adolescents and young adults who develop the heart inflammation, the cases were mild. Many organizations are still recommending vaccination for anybody 12 years of age and older. It happens more frequently in young men and adolescent boys. UCS SF epidemiologist Dr. George Rutherford said the complication is very rare. He is concerned about the Delta variant, even in the heavily vaccinated Bay Area. I'm concerned about it among people who are unvaccinated, which means, you know, children. And it means people who have not yet, yet gotten vaccinated. Infectious disease expert Dr. Monica Gandhi wonders if the U.S. should do what the United Kingdom is practicing, space the two-dose shots out. So that's my recommendation, and that's what I've decided to do with my 13-year-old. I'm going to give a second dose between 8 and 12 weeks. Now, most cases were mild and temporary. The symptoms included chest pain, fatigue, and heart rhythm patterns. Our medical experts say it's something parents should discuss with their pediatricians.